A century ago, World War I was in full swing, and the nation was gripped by a flu pandemic. The first Tarzan film premiered. A horse named War Cloud won the Preakness. And in Nebraska, the Cornhuskers played Notre Dame to a scoreless tie. On campus, big changes were coming in response to the passage of the Smith-Hughes National Vocational Education Act. Many schools were already providing education in agriculture, but it was not from people who were trained to be teachers. And so in 1918, after the Smith-Hughes Act had been passed in 1917, the University of Nebraska developed the Department of Agricultural Education. The program started with just two courses. And by the time the first graduating class was graduated in 1920, there were about 11 courses that were being offered. Over the years, the program evolved with changes tied to the farm economy. Someone who's prepared as a teacher can easily qualify for employment in the ag business industry. And so as the economy would become strong, we would experience a turnover. So many of our undergraduates would teach three to four years and then go off into agribusness. The farm crisis of the 1980s hit enrollment hard and ushered in important developments. We realized in our department that we needed to broaden our base beyond just preparing teachers, but to look at an area that had always been strong in preparation of agriculture instructors, and that would be the area of leadership development and education. New programs in leadership and communication led to renaming the department to better reflect the variety of options. It's been outstanding, the nimbleness of this department. We've been able to springboard not only into leadership development, but also into communication studies and into the ag tourism area. And so we've really broadened that base. But diverse ALEC programs also share an important focus. We study the theories of human potential and human development. We conduct research and extension activities in that and really bring that back to the classroom in an effort to, to truly develop human potential in a way that makes the students who graduate experts in that human connection. I thought we had confirmation that we got it. I really was able to gain a better understanding of what leadership meant and especially how that relates to community involvement and that really set me up for my job really well here at Civic Nebraska. Agricultural education in schools across the state combine classroom and leadership instruction and experiential learning for students. Every day is something different. There's nothing the same. It's just a great experience, just something new every day. And I just love being around the kids. ALEC at the University of Nebraska promises to meet the needs of a changing world. Our graduates really are equipped to go into all sectors of our society, whether that's in the health profession, whether that's in the energy field, whether that's education, public, nonprofit, private. And so developing human potential, in my mind, has never been more important than it is now and will continue to be more important as we see additional stresses and pressures on things like our food supply, water supply, and energy.